the movies of Gawar, Noor as Sharif, Maali Zayed, and others, or Zayed and others. He also mentions about himself that he follows movies, TV shows, and plays such as the movie Irhab and Kebab of of Adil Imam, in which they make fun of practicing people. He issued a verdict that is permissible to look at women that appear on screen. Likewise, he has digressed in many of his fiqh opinions. The following are some of his abnormal views. Okay, so this is now the sixth category regarding his abnormal fiqh views. First, he states that stoning to death is a form of punishment that the leader should cancel out if he sees benefit in it. Number two, he believes that apostasy is of two types. First, an abrasive apostasy which is accompanied by violence against the community. This type of apostate should be executed. And the second is a suppressed apostasy which is every type apart from that and thus the one who falls under it should be left alone. Number three, he holds that women may assume the role of general leadership. Number four, he says that if a woman participates in buying, selling and other transactions that her testimony is like the testimony of a man. Number five, he permits the shaving of the beard. Number six, he permits small amounts of interest, such as one or two percent, based on the justification that it is used for administrative services. Number seven, apart from this, he permits music, entertainment, television channels, TV shows, hanging the garment below the ankles, removing the veil, taking pictures, plays, selling alcohol, and pork to the disbelievers. A Muslim transporting pork limbs, shaking hands with women, dressing up with the clothes of the disbelievers, eating the meat of animals that were killed by lightning, a woman going abroad to study and traveling without a mahram, and much more. It is indeed true what was said about him, that Al-Qurdawi with his verdicts and distortion of Islamic laws is calling out to all those who ascribe to Islam as if he were saying, quote, do whatever you want. For you have already been promised paradise. Unquote. We ask Allah to keep us firm upon Islam and the Sunnah and to grant us refuge from these statements and the ones who make them. And we ask Him to make us from those who adhere to the guidance of the Prophet and his companions. May the peace and the praises of Allah be on our Prophet Muhammad and all of his family and companions. Okay, that's the end of the article. Uh, it can be found on alibana.com. This article was written by Brother Nasir. Nasir bin Hamid al Fahad. Uh, so we ask Allah to reward him for his efforts. Subhanakallah wa bihamdik. Ashru an la ilaha illa ant. Wa astaghfiruka rabbi wa tubu ilayk.